Alright, I'm back. I know I've been gone for a little while. That's because I just got me Sonic Chronicles for the DS. And all I have to say is... Bioware did a damn good job. I think. Yeah, sure, there are, you know, a few problems. You know, I ain't gonna say it's perfect. But it was pretty damn good for basically the first try at it. I mean, really. Alright, I also... I think I know how to do it. I tried it once, and I got it to work kinda with this place right here. Yeah, you do shoot it. Thanks for the tip, whoever that was, I forget. But, then I got killed on the blocks, and I don't know what's after that. So I'm trying that. I just want to know what's down there, damn it. Since now I know it can actually be done. But, alright, back to the Sonic thing. Uh, I just want to say, let's see, two things that I didn't like. One was the way they did the battle system, in a way. Alright, I actually really liked the way they did the touch thing for defending or doing special attacks. That was actually really awesome. It's just one problem. Darn it, why can't I hit the spike anymore? It's just one problem. When you're doing... You know, when you're doing... When you're doing a status kind of attack, or something to heal your team in some way, or empower your team in some way. If you miss even one of the freaking button presses during that whole entire sequence, which sometimes can be like 10 or 12 long, it doesn't work. At all. Fail. You just wasted your turn. But it doesn't work the same way for enemies. And I totally killed myself. It doesn't work the same way for enemies. You can totally miss a few when the enemy is doing a special attack, even if it is a status-only attack, and it still can miss. I just find that kind of mean how it's so strict with when you're doing it, but it can be lenient when the enemy is doing it. I don't know, it just kind of bugged me a lot. Especially with cream. Freaking cream. Whatever. That and the ending. I don't know, they just kind of... Just yeah. Ended too quickly, of course. Darn it! Why can't I hit that? Oh well, that's all I had to say. Other than that, it kicked ass. I thought they did a pretty damn good job in the story. I just always felt, I don't know, I always felt underpowered for some reason. This is coming from a guy who usually low levels everything. They never had enough PP for my taste. They, you could do like two attacks, then you're pretty much done. I thought that was cool. I should probably stop talking about it and focus on this, because they don't seem to be hitting the damn spike. But yeah, that's basically my opinion on it. Alright, let's see if I can do it this time! Darn it! Too early. Which one was it? The third one from the top. Alright. I was shooting at the seventh one. I mean, the sixth one from the top. I was shooting at the seventh one from the top. Sorry! Why do you have to hit it in the first place? Whatever. Ooh, ball move. Alright, let's try this again. There! See? And jump! Aha! Holy crap! I thought that one was right above it. Uh, well, I think I got it now. On my test run, I died on that first block change because it was like right above it, and I was like, what the? Wait, wait! Dead. Thanks a lot. Alright, let's do this again. Yay! Alright. Now it's to the left. Okay. Holy crap! 
I thought I was over to the right! You bastard! Weird! That's not what it did when I died the first time and it showed me all the freaking blocks. It went over to the right. You... You lied to me! The game lied to me! I died and then it started... It kept doing that. The block said it was right over... It went to the right, then it went back, and then it went there. And then it didn't do that when I was alive! Dude, that's just mean, game. Come on. 